And, um, you know, for my first Wimbledon, um, I actually felt pretty good. So I'm excited in, uh, to come back and play next year. So far, so good for defending champion Conchita Martinez. She's safely through to round three. She'd been able to weigh up Jana Kandar at close quarters earlier in the year, dropping just one game. Today, though, it was a little closer, and she ran out a 6-4, 6-3 winner. <laughs> now, how far can Arantxa Sanchez Vicario go at this year's Wimbledon? This is the ninth time she's competed. The quarterfinals are her best effort. Today, she met Mana Endo from Japan. The rallies were long, very long, but eventually the world number two made it through to round three. The score, 7-5, 6-2. Game, set match, Miss Sanchez Vicario. But the number 12 seed, Amy Frazier, was beaten. Irana Spurlea winning in straight sets. Meanwhile, the Wimbledon record books were rewritten on court 16 today. The longest set ever in a women's match. And eventually, Chanda Rubin beat Patricia Heboule 17-15 in the final set. They were on court for three hours, 45 minutes. The 58 games broke the record for the most games in a women's Grand Slam singles match. And just before we leave tonight, let's briefly look at the order of play on the show courts. And starting on centre court, well, Andre Agassi opens up at 2 o'clock, followed by Steffi Graf, both top seeds in action there. And on court number one, well, Boris Becker up first. And following that, well, Joe Dury's match, her last Wimbledon, remember, she faces the number four seed, Jana Novotna. Well, Chris, I just have to say thank you very much for coming in. Sorry we had some sad news yes, <laughs> tonight. It was, wasn't but, uh, it? But thanks very much. Tim Penman has certainly learnt a hard lesson tonight. There's no doubt that the most positive story today was Greg Rosedsky defeating the 16th seed Guy Forget. The British number one showing a rare combination of delight and desire. Good night. On Saturday night at 9, Rock Family Trees explores the history of the bands who put the beat into Birmingham. Prepare for an assault on the senses at 9.50 with Saturday Night Armistice. Then at 10.25, it's Seinfeld. I was so nervous before I called, I made up this whole list of things to talk about. Who's on the list? Oh, I'm very good at going in reverse in my car. At 10.50, Rosanna Arquette is desperately seeking Susan. I'm desperate. You? <laughs> Saturday night on BBC Two. Film action on BBC One shortly with the Cassandra Crossing. That's except in Scotland. This is BBC Two. Now Newsnight with Jeremy Paxman.